Hi, I'm Princess Nokia, and this is everything that I eat in a day. I love to cook. I chef it up in the kitchen. I got good, and I chef it good. I like to typically start my day at six in the morning, and I drink a nice fresh cup of peppermint tea. I will make a fresh juice of fresh fruit, or I will alternate with fresh greens. So I like to make a nice fruit smoothie with strawberries, pineapples, mangoes, green apple, a little turmeric powder for inflammation, honey. Maybe some dragon fruit, maybe some soursop. I just love fruit. It's the best thing. It's the most purifying, nourishing thing that you could have. And I like to take care of my body, honey. I'm all about health and wealth. If you're not on your health and wealth, we're not on the same page. Like when I talk about, I really care about what I put in my body, I really care about what I put in my body. Every morning, I do fresh ginger shots. I drink a fresh cup of ginger, lemon, and orange with cayenne pepper and turmeric all day. I've been studying holistic medicine and holistic eating for a few years now, so I've kind of got like my routines. Because I am a heavy smoker, I like to smoke a lot of weed, and I need my lungs and my respiratory system to be as healthy as it can be. I'll be blowing it down. Then um, around eight or nine o'clock, I like get a, a big appetite. I like Caribbean breakfast. Caribbean breakfast is my favorite. You know, I'm a Caribbean girl, like I'm Puerto Rican. So I like doing my own vegan version of Tres Golpas, which is actually from Dominican Republic. I like to make fresh mango with red, with red onion. That's so good. Oh my God, that's so delicious. It's like a creamy starch. It's like green plantains butter, margarine, and, and vinegar. It's like making mashed potatoes, except it's a Dominican mashed potatoes. I don't eat uh, pork or red meat, so I don't do salami frito. Instead, I'll just do huevo frito, which is fried eggs, and maybe a little queso frito, but I try not to eat too much cheese. And then, you know, it's like, maybe I'll do like farina or porridge with fresh fruit. Maybe I'll do patatas bravas, which is Spanish style potato wedges, but I like to not eat a nice, good, healthy breakfast and it always has some Spanish Caribbean accent to it. For lunch, I could really chef up a good sandwich. I don't play when it comes to sandwiches and anyone who see my Instagram story will know that not only do I like, let me not even brag about it. <laughs> I will do a good turkey sandwich. I need sourdough bread, some good vegan eggs, a little honey, honey glazed turkey sliced thin. I need every all my cold cuts to be sliced thin. If you're not slicing it thin, please, I'm gonna send it back. We're gonna tell the Aki's no, I can't have that. And I put potato chips in my sandwich, boo boo, because I love a good crunch. Then I could f up a nice Jack Crew po boy. That's like from the South. That's good, throw that down. I like to make a nice Vietnamese banh mi sandwich. Fried tofu, seasoned really well on a fresh French baguette, carrot, cucumber, you know the vibes. Shout out to my brothers and sisters in Vietnam. Around three o'clock, I like to have a nice snack, which is subsequently the, the time that I like to um, roll up a nice spliff and have a nice peach tea. And that's like when I catch up with some reading or you know, I catch up with some friends. A food I actively avoid is like fast food. I don't, I don't play with no fast food. Do it, does it look like I play with fast food? No. I don't eat pork, y'all. No, ain't no pork on this fork. But if y'all take me to Mexico, I'm gonna have to eat a pastor taco. Cause they have the most delicious pastor. And it's just, it's everything. Changed my life. My mother's from Luquillo, Puerto Rico. So if I'm in Luquillo, I'm gonna have my Puerto Rican cuchifrito food. Patelillos, my pateles, my papa relleno. A nice little crab patelillo by the beach with a nice beer, good to go. Dinner, I really like, I put music on, put the radio on, and I'm chefing it up. I'm not playing around. I don't like ordering out too much. So me, I like to make different variations of all my different type of favorite food from different cultures, Italian, Spanish, Puerto Rican, Mexican, Thai, Japanese. I like to do it all. I could do a, a nice arroz habichuela con pollo, which is fried chicken with rice and beans. I put on a nice fresh pot of rice, and then I got my good beans. I like to make, I, I could really F up some good beans, baby. I do pink beans, two sofritos, calabaza, potato, carrot, onion. Mm. It needs to have good oil, I only cook with coconut oil, olive oil. If I do a bolognese, I got the spaghetti. I take my vegan meat, 
I get my sauce. I learned how to make pasta from my uncle who was in jail with a lot of Sicilian men. So when it comes to slicing our garlic and cooking our garlic, we take it very seriously. <laughs> it's a very good system. I could do some tacos dorados, which is a Mexican dish. It's your version of taquitos. Or we could do flautas. My favorite meal to cook is a, a typical Puerto Rican sancocho. I love to make sancocho or soup. It's just like I put so much vegetables, root vegetables, in it, corn, chunks of corn, potatoes, calabaza, carrot. But it's the process. It's creating the broth. Yeah, you need that broth takes like about an hour of work, two hours of work, and you want the seasoning, the sazon, the the, the sofrito to hit just right. You need all the notes of all of the flavors. And I'm always so proud of it when I make it. It's dumb good. And that's everything that I eat in a day. Please go stream Everything Sucks and Everything is Beautiful in my new song, I Like Him. Bye.